didn't seem like very bitch mode greeting. It seemed very friendly to me. I want to come back later. I'm making a video. I want to talk to people that sell things like this at gay fairs. But I have to get, can't do it with this music. Yeah, I'm back. We're gonna, we're going to have to, um, to do the interview with the sound. What, you, what is this for? Oh, I, I was to, to ask you permission. I'm doing a document. I'm going around to different fairs, especially with gay fairs, and just talk to people about the merchandise they create and they sell. Okay. You know, and, and, and you know it's what? All our original designs. Right. This is all our original stuff. Diane's the artist. Thank you. Uh huh? And is there any, any? Uh, I mean, are there any? Any particular uh, themes that you know? She Hall. I mean, that's very well, clever. Based on the All our merchandise is based on the inside jokes of the gay community. So uh -huh. the She Hall truck, uh, right. Joan Crawford. Uh huh. What is what is this? Is this the Rocky Horror Picture Show? Uh, no, that was just because that's in our logo and people like the lips, so oh. we figure we make a print out of it. Right. So when the lady loves is Diane's idea. Oh, that's cute. Yes, you can. You just go to right to our website. Um, our email address has changed. Now. We need to work that now. If you don't want to pay shipping. What is your email address? Our email address yeah. is info at bitchmoproductions.com. Oh. So, let us know whatever you want. We got new prints coming out. So. And how long have you been doing this? Uh, we've been in business a year. We're still uh -huh. doing, we do wholesale and retail. Oh. We do the festivals, but we do have uh, our merchandise in stores, and we're going out to California with the Gay Expo in California. Oh. In September. We'll be in the gay life. Do you, you earn a living doing it, or is it a Not hobby? Yet. It's a part time. We're just uh, everything. All the money that we generate goes back into the business. So uh -huh. we haven't seen a profit yet, but we're just getting there. So we're hoping this year it turns around. And what do, what do most of the t-shirts run? Sorry? What do they sell for? Uh, $10. Oh. $10. Come on. Yeah, you can't beat that, right? No. no. T-shirt without anything on it would cost $10. Exactly. So we're having a lot of fun with it. Is that the back or the back? Is there any, any motifs that like, any particular one that like is... Is one or two or three that are really popular more than oh, others? The most popular is our Joan and Bitch Mode on. Oh, really? Yeah. These are two best sellers. And also the She Hall sells the batteries in the gay street. They're like our main Hi. 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 You're in New Hope. Yes. How are you? Fine. Fine. What's going on? Oh, I just I came out here because I'm doing footage for. You know. Yeah, yeah. How how do you do how did how did New Hope work out? A Actually, it worked out okay. Yeah, it was good. Yeah. We're doing better today. Uh, I think the weather's with us. It's warmer. It's fun to come out. Well, I, I would think since you wholesale as well as retail, all you need to do is pick up one or two outlets that reorder that make yeah. an event worthwhile, we're right? Yeah. yeah, we're doing that now. Yeah. So that's starting to happen for us. Are you going to be in New York? Uh, uh, the no, big parade? Actually, we're going to be in uh, Columbus, Ohio. Oh. Wow. Are you going to go to any other fairs in New York? No. Uh, we'll be in Asbury Park tomorrow. Oh. You going to go to Asbury? No, I'm going to go to Queens. Okay. I had to make a choice. Uh, okay. And, you know, Queens is easier. Okay. Have but, you been to Asbury yet? No. Oh, it's awesome. That's a big one. I, I understand yeah. Brooklyn is huge. Oh, yeah? We haven't been to that one. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah. Queens isn't as big as Brooklyn. This is this is awfully small. It's their first fair. I didn't know that. Yeah, well, great. Really have your job cut out for you here. I've interviewed people. A lot of people have great failures. One or two are delirious because they've done fabulous business, but they're the minority. Because it's all experimental, you know. Yeah, exactly. I'm sure if you knew it was going to have this kind of, you would not expect to spend your day holding up the uh, the support. You know, it wasn't what I had in mind. But if that's what it takes to do business, do it. <laughs> have you have you been developing mail order? Mail order? No, we have a website. Thank you so Marketing much. Through our website, we do festivals. Uh -huh. Are you guys doing wholesale? Well, I mean, that's the key, so that's the key to small business and kind of why we jumped into it. So you got to find your niche. Right?
my goodness, what a small world it is. I was certain, I was positive I wouldn't find you here today. <laughs> Last year when you were here, literally holding on, I mean, you were being blown away with the wind. And it's such a wonderful example of when you deal in an outdoor festival. I know, you never know what you're going to get with weather. So you must have found it worthwhile coming here. Or? Wow. Yeah, I wish the weather was cooperating today. It's a little chilly. I know, I, I thought when I came up here, I thought the ditch mode. The Mitch Boat County was smart to not come because it may rain at any moment. I know. I, I told a person I might set out for the to go to the fair, and if a thunderstorm and lightning is going, you know, I'm just going to turn and go back oh, in yeah, the building. Yeah, we would have too, but it's that bad. But we were, we were trying to be optimistic because they were calling for possible so, so how are you doing in, in developing retail outlets and building a business? Good. We're good. We're, we're mostly developing our online uh, store, oh. storeproductions.com. So. Is there any new? Yeah, we have some new prints. Um, they're out on the side there as well. Oh, these? Yeah, all of these. Uh, Bitch, bitch, everywhere USA? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Pretty much all the others are the one more existing ones, the one that's uh -huh. heavy Well, I'm glad. So, so, so I'm, I'm really happy to see you uh, still so in there. I ran into these, these, these very nice people working under the name of, these nice women working under the name, I can say lesbians, can't I? Of course. Yeah, working under the name Bitch Mode Productions, and I show the introduction, and I thought I ran into them later at the Staten Island That's Fair. Great. Are you going to make that available? To, you know, yes, I'll publish it on the internet. Right. When I do, you will get a notice and a link of where it's at. Okay, do you have our information? Yes, so I, I do. Like to get that from you. Right. Give me another card, just so if, it, if I, I have them all in packets by the fair, I know I can find it, and I can look up Bitch Mode Productions online, too, right? Our information is on there. Oh, great. Well, thank you very much.